So let's say I want to do something called a custom data validation. So you can find a lot of formulas online uh, if you don't know the exact formula what you're looking for. But in my case over here, I'm going to just validate this area with, tech, with numbers and this area with text. Because in symbol number, I just want the numbers and in name, I just want uh, the uh, I just want uh, the text. So over here inside of symbol number, I'm going to go into data validation and then going to go into allow custom. So in the formula, I'm going to type equals and I just want numbers over here. So I'm going to say is number open a bracket, select the range just like this and close the bracket and press OK. So now this area just accept the numbers. So over here, if I were to press A, for example, it does not allow me to enter A. So I do have to add in the numbers over here and it'll allow the numbers. But if I were to add in 2A, it will not allow the numbers as you can see. It will only accept uh, the, uh, it'll only accept numbers. Over here in name, now I just want this section to accept uh, the text. So I'm going to go into data validation right here. I'm gonna go over here and custom. I'm going to add in the formula is text because I want the field to just accept text. And I'm going to select this out just like this. And I'm going to close the bracket right here and press OK. So now if I were to enter number here, it won't accept it. So I can actually type in my name or something like that and it does accept the number as you can see right here. So that is how you can do custom data validation inside of Microsoft Excel. Hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like, comment, share and subscribe.